I woke up on the couch this morning and realized ghosts pushed me out of my bedroom. Because most nights, I end up sleeping in the living room. So I woke up. It was dark outside, but I thought the sun was coming up because I had my lights on. And I went back to sleep uh, thinking, okay, sun's up. We're good. Uh, <laughs> I woke up, I think, again, realizing, wait a second. It's like pitch dark outside still. Um, and so I was looking through the windows or the curtains trying to see like, wait a second, why did I think it was light? But it was just because the lights were on and it was weird because I could swear that I looked out the windows, not out them, but I could see through the curtains and I could swear there was light coming in through them, but no, apparently not. Um, so, oof. okay. I just saw a flash in the hallway. It knows I'm talking about it. Um, anyways, um, where was I? I just had a horrifying realization. So my general routine is when it gets dark, I turn some lights on. Um, and then when I'm about to go to sleep, I turn certain lights on that block that thing's path. Um, and then when I wake up in the morning, I wait till it's daylight outside and then I turn the lights off and usually I go back to bed for a little bit. Um, but as soon as it starts to show some signs of daybreak, the lights go off. I think that the reason that I thought the light was coming through the windows, I think that thing was trying to trick me into turning the lights out because I distinctly remember saying to myself, oh, I can turn the lights off, but I'm too tired to get up and do it. So I'm just going to lay here and go back to sleep. <laughs> so it almost got me, but yeah, it didn't. I was too clever. Actually, no, I was too tired is what happened. I believe this thing feeds on fear. So if I have another emotion going on, I'm not as focused on it. Like the other day I had like immense pain. I slept in my room. I could feel it leaning over me, but I'm like, you know what? At this point, do your worst because I was in such excruciating pain. I didn't even care. I was like, you know what? I don't care. I just, I, I couldn't deal with the pain. And then I was like, you know what, if, if nothing else, at least I'm going to be comfortable. So that's why I slept in my room. Um, other than that, it's like this ongoing thing, uh, just to kind of, you know, create a buffer between myself and that. So that's what the light does. It creates a buffer to the fear. So that's why I've kind of established that. And I believe that my friends and a couple of family or one friend and a couple family members have corroborated that they think it feeds on fear as well. But yeah, this is what I'm pretty much dealing with on a daily basis. And, um, so the sun is up, the lights are out and I'm going to try to get back to bed.